how to add Amazon affiliate links to Linktree. Hello everyone and welcome back. In today's video, I'll be showing you guys how you can add your Amazon affiliate links on to Linktree. Now, this used to be pretty simple where you would just add your link directly. But recently, Linktree has introduced the feature of a separate shop area where you can link all of your Amazon affiliates, all of the products you might be selling, promoting, and this makes it really easy for you to disclose if any item is being promoted and it makes sure that you're not going to be in binds with the law. So let's jump right in. To get started, simply head on over to your Linktree account and you also want to log in to your Amazon account. Now with Amazon affiliate links, you have to become an Amazon associate. And once you are a Amazon associate, you have the ability to basically take any product that you like off of Amazon and you can take any product you like. And from the top, you're going to see your site stripe as you guys can see over here. In your site stripe, you have the option to get the link and you can just click on this text option. This will show your store ID as well as your tracking ID provided by Amazon affiliates and you have either a short link or a full link that you can copy and then paste onto Linktree. So you're simply going to take a product of your choice. One thing I always recommend when you're doing Amazon Associates or Amazon Affiliate products is to take products that you actually like. You don't want to promote a random product because if you already have a particular brand, let's say I already have a brand where I am affiliated or associated with makeup, then I want to use makeup products. I want to promote with makeup products. But if my personal brand is maybe cars or tech, and then I am promoting makeup using Amazon affiliates on my link tree, no one from my audience is going to be interested in that. So for that purpose, you want to just make sure that your image is pretty in line with the products that you are promoting. Now, once you have chosen a product, you're going to click on text on the top left and you are just going to copy this. You're going to get your link over here. We're going to click on get link and our link is generated and we can just copy that. Now you're going to head on over into Linktree. Now I have a detailed video already on how you can create your Linktree account. So make sure to check that out if you want to learn about the basics of Linktree. Now, once you have gone into Linktree, you're going to click on shop on the left. And once you click on shop on the left, you're going to add your first product. So simply type in your product link and then click on add. This will extract all of the product information off of Amazon and you're going to wait a couple of seconds so that Linktree can take your direct link or your affiliate link and then take the product. So now over here, it's going to show you the URL as well as the title. Now I want to change the title and I always recommend that you guys do that as well simply because it makes it easier for people to read it. Now it says Elf Cosmetics Glossy Lip Stain. I just need to write Elf Glossy Lip Stain. I don't think I want to include Elf Cosmetics and I don't want to include the, uh, the rest of the keywords. And I think I even want to write Elf like this because it's more recognizable for my audience in this way because most people write Elf with caps letters. Then you have the price that is displayed this is the current price on Amazon and below that I have the option to show it in my shop which means that it will be displayed on your Linktree shop outside of your direct link collection. So if I add this to my shop I'll click on add product and this will add the product in the shop panel. However if I open this up and I remove it from my shop and I save these changes like this so you guys can see it's not going to be added in the shop. So for that purpose, you can build different collections onto the Linktree shop as well. So for that, you can just go into collections over here. And once you've added your first product, the collection option uh, starts to appear on the shop section. So we're going to click on add product. We're going to add our first product. 
And if you want to change the image of the product that you have chosen, simply open up the product listing and you will see besides the image on the bottom right, you have the option to upload your own image. Now you might say, hey, this is an Amazon Associates product. Why would I want to upload a different image? Well, if you have a image of you using that product, if you have a video of you using that product, a screen cap, then you might want to use that instead. Your audience might relate to that a bit more. So for that purpose, you can choose to edit that. Now I am going to add my lip product recommendations like this, and then I'll just click on done. Now this will appear as a separate section. Now there is another way that you can structure this. So if you want to do a separate shop tab where it's only Amazon Associates product, then you can simply create a collection that is called your Amazon links or Amazon storefront. You can link that over here as well. This is up to your personal preference if you want to categorize the individual types of products that you're promoting via Amazon versus creating just one section that is dedicated or designated for all of the Amazon product links. Now on the top right, you also have your shop settings. If you want to display your shop separately, if you want to set the shop as the main tab, so whenever people open up your link tree, if they should be led to the link section or the shop section over here, I want to make the shop the primary thing that people have access to. Then you have the preview shop in the links page as well. Then you can click on add product and you can get started with adding more Amazon affiliate products. In the same way, you're just going to take the product that you want to promote. Let's say it's this product. You're going to copy the associates link that is provided and you're going to go back into Linktree and then you're going to paste in the link over here. And once you paste in the Amazon link into Linktree, it's again going to extract all the info from Amazon. It's going to ask you how you want to display it, the entire thing. So I'm just going to add this as Halo Glow Liquid Filter. And then I'm just going to delete the rest of it. We have the price as well. And after that, I'll just click on Add Product. Now, once I've done that, I can choose whether I want to include this in the previous collection or if I want this to be added as a separate product. Now, if you display items in a collection, that means people will have to click on the collection and then get access. Whereas if a item or product is uncategorized, it's going to directly appear under the shop tab. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and you are now able to view and add Amazon affiliate links onto your link tree. If you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And if you have any questions or queries, leave those in the comment box down below. I would love to know what you guys have to say.